You're watching the Mr. White Show. Should I do it again? We all know the guy code, you know, if I'm dating a chick and we broke up and you're my best friend or you're a close home of mine, don't go after that bitch. Get a friend, but don't get her. It's been going on for years, but a lot of niggas break the rules, you know. Or they see, oh, I tell you that I'm going after this bitch, all right? Just, just don't, don't, don't talk to her. That's my bitch. I like her. You know what I'm saying? Okay, bro, I got you, man, I got you. As you know, I see you fucking trying to DM her, you trying to, you know what I mean? You sneaky motherfucker trying to get up in there. Which the other nigga thought I was doing to his bitch, but he was sadly mistaken, but fuck him and her. But anyway, don't think that I, I'm that type of nigga, man. If you tell me, yo, bro, yo, I like that bitch, man. Don't, don't fuck with her, you know what I mean? I won't. Just like that. I'm not gonna ask you no questions. You like her? I bet. It's all you, son. It's all you. Vice versa, if it was for me, if I like this chick, you know, I'm feeling this bitch, you know, I'm trying to smash, of course, but I, I like her, you know, just don't talk to her, you know, talk to a friend or something, you know what I mean, if we at work or, you know what I mean, or, you know what I mean, and then you violate that, you said, oh, yeah, yeah, okay, you tell me something, and then you do another another thing, you go behind my back, you broke the homie code, and you fucked up, so this video, this episode of the Mr. White Show is dedicated to these motherfuckers who violate and don't know what time it is and, and act like they're your friends, your niggas, and they fuck with you, you know, behind your back, talking shit. Yeah, I don't think you should talk to him, man. You know, I think I'm better for you. You know, I, I, I have a car. He doesn't have a car. You know, he still living at home with his mama. You know, I got my own place. You know, I, don't, I don't know what the scenario is, but fucked up, though, man. It's supposed to be your boy. He's fucking you behind your back. All right? And that's it. Never rub another man's rhubarb. Peace. Because this is the final.